Kia ora team, I'm TJ Pedernara, professional rugby player here in New Zealand. Today, I'm gonna to show you how I train endurance. Endurance is critical for us on a rugby field, especially for the full 80 minutes, we need to have the energy stores to last the game. The last two or three minutes of the game might be the most important, so we need to be ready. There are many different ways you can train endurance, but today, I'm gonna to show you how I train mine. Let's go. So here, we're jumping on the bike for about 20 to 30 minutes. The bike is perfect for building overall endurance and cardiovascular fitness. By jumping on the bike, instead of going for a run, you deload the joints and reduce risk of injury. For this session, we're going 30 seconds hard, 30 seconds easy for 20 to 30 minutes. What you wanna do, chuck it on hard, get into your work. Once your 30 seconds is up, you bring it back down. Make sure you keep your legs spinning, keep things ticking over, so that when you get ready for your next 30, we're ready to go. So now we're gonna jump outside and get into our 60 meter repeated efforts. So this is gonna be hard. We've got 12 by 60 meter shuttles. What you wanna do is get there on 10 seconds, rest for 10 seconds, and then we're straight back into it going again. Don't wanna go out too hard too early. Make sure you use the 10 seconds to get there so that you got enough left in the tank to make sure you finish all 12 reps. Depending on the location, ensure you have the correct footwear. Ensure open space, a level ground. The adaptions in the muscles of your legs, your heart, and your ability to deal with the lactic acid will make you fitter, building more endurance so you can run for longer. All right, when things start to get hard, I want you to focus on three things. One, arm speed. Your legs will always move as fast as your arms are going. Two, posture. Hold good posture. And three, make sure to breathe. All right, third and final exercise, 15 meter sprints. We purposely saved them for last because we want a little bit of fatigue in our legs from the last two exercises to really test our speed endurance. It's really important for us in game to have this because later on in the game, when we're a little bit tired, we still want to be explosive. We still want to be able to execute at a really high speed. For me, it's really important to be explosive at the start. You want to get out of the blocks quick and be really powerful in that point. You want to hold your posture and make sure you're accelerating through the 15 meters. You then walk back, get your recovery, and we go again. Every rep counts. All right, that's us all done with our endurance session. It's a killer, but if you want to become a faster and fitter player, Make sure you hit the session once or twice a week. Let's go.